Today we're looking back at some of the coolest critters we put in tanks. And this is a rare time where a tank had no fish at all. So talk to us, what are you guys looking for? Crab tank. Okay. Something different, we wanted to showcase our crabs, man. I like that. John and Mark own Crab Corner here in Vegas. They're both Maryland-born boys. We fly them in fresh every day from the Chesapeake Bay. Flown in live crab right off the every boat. Every day, yeah. Crabs are scientifically called Kalanectus sapitus, which means beautiful swimmer that is savory. But thankfully, this wasn't for crabs that was gonna be eaten. This one's for people to see. People come in and look at it, understand what they do, where they live, how they are, and then we want the ATM experience, man. Show them what we got. Got it. So that's exactly what we gave them. The boat-shaped acrylic tank was docked on top of a stand, concealing the filtration. Since crabs prefer things simple, just a bare-bottom tank inspired by the bottom of the bay, showcased the blue crabs straight from the Chesapeake. The whole thing was then topped off with an authentic wood crab boat facade. We've used other aquarium crabs like hermit crabs and horseshoe crabs in our tanks, but this was the first tank that we made just for blue crabs. Blue crabs only live to be about three years old, but in that time, the female can lay over eight million eggs. No wonder there's over 550 million crabs in the Chesapeake Bay. Like all crabs, blue crabs have a hard exoskeleton that doesn't grow. That means a few times throughout a crab's life, they have to shed their shells when they grow out of them. When it's time, they remove their current shell, pull in as much water as possible for a few hours, then start to grow their new shell. When they're in their in-between stage, they're known as soft shell crab. The stage doesn't last very long. Within 12 hours, they get a completely new shell that hardens within three days. 